Hey guys, it is Keith here with a haul video because you guys like to see how much money I spend on Disney stuff, which is usually a ridiculous amount. So today it is Zoom Zoom Tuesday, and I've got a whole bunch of Zooms here. The latest release, which is the largest set ever released so far on a Zoom Zoom Tuesday. So just in case you guys didn't know what Zoom Zoom Tuesday is, it's the first Tuesday and now also third Tuesday of the month where they release a new Zoom Zoom set. And in this case, it is Zootopia, which is Disney Animation Studios latest film. And then later this month, it's going to be Star Wars. So look forward to many more Zoom Zooms. So for those of you that don't know about Zootopia, which is coming out on March 4th, we have Judy Hopps here. Judy Hopps is voiced by Jennifer Goodwin, who you may know as Snow White slash Mary Margaret from the ABC show Once Upon a Time. Judy is the first bunny cop of Zootopia. Her partner, Nick Wilde, voiced by Jason Bateman, is the con artist Fox. Together, they're the heart of the film, racing to solve a case within 48 hours. And we are talking about a missing mammal, actually multiple missing mammals. One is a very cute otter, which they didn't make as a Sioux. But one of these people, or mammals rather, is the villain and we don't know in good old Disney animation surprise fashion, one of these is a villain and we don't know which one it is. So going down the list, I want you guys to give me guesses in the comments on who you think is going to be the villain of Zootopia. I'll give you my insight, but yeah, let's go ahead and look at the rest of the Zoom Zooms. First on the list, we have Chief Bogo. Chief Bogo is the head of the Zootopia Police Department. He's reluctant with Judy Hopps being added to his squad since he's used to working with rhinos, elephants, and others. Chances of him being the villain I don't think are very high because he has a police Mammal, not police man, police mammal, and I don't know. I think it's way too easy if he were the villain since he already has a tough exterior. So, moving down the list, we now have Benjamin Clawhauser, who is another police officer in the department. Benjamin is a very charming cheetah who loves donuts and the pop star Gazelle. And this is Gazelle right over here. So, he loves Gazelle and donuts. So, he's already kind of one of my favorites because you guys know I love donuts. But yeah, Benjamin Clawhouse, I don't think is a villain because he looks way too happy and he's going to be like one of those fluffy animals that everybody loves. Um, gazelle here. Gazelle is a gazelle voiced by Shakira and sings the film's inspirational theme song, Try Everything. So over here now we have a very early fan favorite. Flash the Sloth works at the DMV, the Department of Mammal Vehicles, as seen in the trailers already released. Fun fact about Flash, or rather his co-worker, Priscilla the Sloth is a voice cameo by Kristen Bell, who is better known for voicing Frozen's Princess Anna. It's fitting that she voices Priscilla because of her very public obsession with sloths, where she has confessed to it on many places such as The Ellen Show. Next on the list we have Yax the Yak. Yax is the most enlightened, laid-back naturalist in Zootopia. It's a pretty fair guess that he's not the villain in the film. I'm gonna attack this guy at the same time. Yes, this guy. These are the two that come as a double in the set where it's the same character. So this is Finnick and this is Finnick in an elephant costume. He is a Finnick fox that's also Nick Wilde's partner in crime in all of the cons. Um, don't know much about him, but I don't think he's a villain. Let me know though. Do you think he is? One thing about Finnick though is that in his elephant form, he has a heart on his belly which is kind of cool considering they don't usually put designs on the bottom of the Tsum Tsums, but they have in this series. Um, like here we have Nick Wilde, going back to Nick, he has a tie on, so that's pretty cool. Okay, so we have four left, and we have Mr. Big here. Mr. Big is an Arctic Shrew who is the most feared crime boss in Tundra Town. This character seems to pay tribute to the Godfather. And he looks kind of mean compared to everybody else here, but don't think he's a villain. It's That's way too easy. And then over here, we have Jerry Jumbo Jr. Jerry Jumbo Jr., the elephant, is the easily annoyed owner of the ice cream parlor. Kind of an insignificant character, I think, compared to everybody else. I'm surprised they don't have the otter as a Tsum Tsum, because you guys know I love otters. But here we go, Jerry Jumbo Jr., not a villain. It's kind of safe to say, 99% sure in that. 99.99% sure. Um, which leaves me down to these two. Mayor Lionheart is the noble leader of Zootopia who coined the city's mantra that Judy Hopps lives by, in Zootopia, anyone can be anything. 
possibly the villain. But then there's also the assistant mayor, Bellwether. Bellwether is a sweet sheep, but is constantly overshadowed by the larger-than-life Mayor Lionheart. Fun fact about her, Jenny Slate voices Bellwether, but you might know her as Marcel the Shell. But, um, I don't know, I don't want Bellwether to be a villain, because look how cute she is, and she's a sheep and everything, but like, that position that she's in gives her every reason to be a villain should she want to be. So we have these two characters which, which are my guess to be a villain. One of these two. But I want to know, you guys, what do you think? Let me know in the comments down below. And that is it for me guys, thank you for watching the video. Make sure you check out Zootopia when it hits theaters in March. And let me know, once again, comment below, who do you think is a villain? It doesn't have to be these two. If you think it's one of these guys, it could even be like Judy Hopps if you actually think Judy Hopps is the bad guy. Um, let me know in the comments down below. Make sure you subscribe to all of my social media accounts if you love more Disney content. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you guys. Bye.